Hello everybody, and today I'm up at 6 in the morning because I have to uh, do an attendance for online school. Not like a video chat or anything, I just gotta go online and click a button by a certain time, and if I don't do it, then I'm marked absent. But, I'm gonna teach you how you could buy, or not bypass that, but just set up like a simple auto clicker bot, so you don't have to get up at some ungodly hour, i.e. like before 10 o'clock. Next thing we wanna do is get the macro scheduler. Uh, just download here, just look up free micro scheduler download get started today run the exe that looks good uh this is just the trial version this is a full version though but i'm not gonna fork the money for it so what you do is set up a simple macro you just go to macro scheduler uh then you hit record name it something like test start it okay and for this one, we're just going to open Chrome, open a website, and then close that website. Then we're going to reopen our macro, our macro scheduler and stop it. Cool. Let's just see how that runs really quick. Run it. Okay. So we see it opening Chrome, opening website, then immediately closing, like, closing that website in the top right. And we see it opening macro scheduler, even though it's already open. It's just programmed to do that. And then stopping itself. Cool. So we have our first simple macro right there. Uh, then we got to make a new thing. A new kind of script thing. No, I already know this stuff. Uh, run when. So the current time is 7.08. I'm going to make it go off at 7.10. Cool. We're going to save this really quick as like uh, test part 2. Enter the, oh yeah, days. Yeah, you, you need to set days. Today's Tuesday. Make sure you put that. That's important. Okay, save. Cool. Um, so you see our test part two macro. Then we're gonna open this really quick. We're gonna open file location. Uh, then we're gonna we're, we're gonna edit it. Uh, so this is just our macro with all the different positions on the screen. Uh, this is my file directory. It's kind of blurred because it has my, it's got my name in it. So I'm just gonna hit Control A, and then Control C to copy everything here. Then I'm gonna close this. Then I'm gonna close this. I'm gonna go here to test part two. I'm gonna hit, uh, I'm gonna right click the screen, then edit macro, and then now, and then I'm gonna paste it in, and then save it. Okay. So it's currently 7.09, um, and in 35 seconds, it should start running the macro. All right, here we go. Just hit 7.10, so it's opening up Google Chrome, opening up ish.io, then immediately closing the tab, just as I programmed it to do. And we see it opening itself again, and then uh, stopping. That's it. So that's how you set up a, a simple timed macro. Uh, you should like the video, because now you don't have to wake up early and do this sign-in thing.